let's start our animation lessons okay uh, we're uh, pretty much done with the rig um, there's a few things we can add like a shoulder automation and uh, FK IK switch but other than that uh, we can start animating now all right so let's do a uh, cycle um, a walk cycle exaggerated walk cycle all right so let me just prepare our uh, character right here for the uh, initial pose all right so i'm going to curl the uh, and the entire lesson is uh, available uh, it's an entire series so we're going to just kind of curl that a little bit maybe we should put this out a little bit out right here all right i'll do the same thing here okay and probably uh, curl the thumb right here rz okay All right, just so that they're not too stiff. All right. Now let's set up the uh, uh, the body right here. So exaggerated, super exaggerated walk. Okay, so we we'll grab one of the foot. And then the other one back. Okay, let's do our foot roll. Okay, let's make it really exaggerated. All right, like this guy, super happy. Okay, um, let's do the arms. Let me fix that thumb right there. Just basically just posing this uh, character that's all we're doing all right and let's see facial expressions um, probably leave it like this and uh, so let's see all right because we'll just uh do the loop um all right super happy and smiling all right let's do uh some rotations now so Okay, and then we'll, oops. Oh, I think I did the opposite.
All right, maybe a little too much. All right, for exaggeration, that's probably fine right there. All right, let's take a look at our elbow. Okay, now for the head. All right, let's do a little bit of the uh, spine. Set the uh, eyes kind of high level like that. All right, so that's our, and we're gonna do uh, something where we can easily uh, kind of control here. Okay, uh, we're gonna do something where you can easily control. So we'll do uh, one to uh, we'll do a twenty four frames. Uh, it's a lot easier to explain because it's you know divisible. We got 12 as a halfway mark, 24 frames per second. Okay, and then we can always kind of retime it. So this will be a cycle. Okay, so once you have your pose like that, of course, I kind of did that super quick. Um, you could also do uh, some shoulder um, uh, animation here where you can, you know, you can um, rotate um, some of the shoulder kind of. Um, and the hip you can swing it a little bit like that and whatnot so then you can correct it right here okay but uh, I think we'll we'll we're happy with that for now okay so for demoing purpose all right so that's our walk right there so I have the pose so I will save this now okay so we're gonna call this one 11 now and we're going to call it uh these are the animation series now so leo walk cycle animation and it's kind of like series 11 right there all right let's save that okay and then uh we'll um, we'll have um running uh push box push up all that kind of stuff all right so i'm going to go to the uh, number three right here. All right, so what we want to do here is while in post mode, we're going to select everything, okay? And then the two type of, um, uh, actually, let me um, let me put a floor here real quick, just so that we could see, uh, forgot about that. Let's put a plane real quick and uh, totally forgot about the floor. We'll go, let's say five okay good enough and then that thing is way too bright let's just kind of lower it a little uh a bit okay so now uh we could see um uh, easily if we look at the bottom and we could see if we're gonna be animating on the below the floor okay so press a to select everything okay and you press k and then location and rotation so we're keying everything all right so um we can also do our uh auto keying uh you can turn it on if you want to so you can make uh, subtle changes later on which is fine okay so here we want to be watching our uh dope sheet and uh, there we go so we got our keyframe right there okay 
All right, so um, we're gonna put our dope sheet and then we can just use our keyboard shortcut K to, uh, to do our keying instead of uh, looking at the playback control. All right, so we want this to cycle, right? And our cycle is gonna be on um, 24. So all this, basically this is a bunch of keys right here, okay? That got animated, okay? And what we want is, um, while all of those keys are um, selected, okay? We want to just simply duplicate this to 24 so that it will um, it will cycle. So the first and the last uh, uh, keys are exactly the same. So we know for a fact it's going to repeat, all right? So what we want here on frame 12 is to do the opposite of the position, right? So we want um, uh, we want uh, frame 12 where all these keys right here would flip uh, positions okay so that's easy to do um, while we have everything selected we simply go to post okay we're gonna go copy post right we're gonna copy this one okay Let me make sure I got that selected copy pose and then we go to frame 12 we simply just do pose flipped and as you can see it did the opposite okay so if I slide this now I mean we're gonna have a really all right but that's a cycle right there okay we just need to add other elements to it oh, look at that Let's see. Uh, maybe too much curvature in that posture, but it's an exaggerated walk, right? Okay, so now we've got that pretty easy. We just position, right? Now let's uh, do our passing position. So our left foot is forward here, okay? So we go around frame six. And again, it's, you know, it's kind of mechanical uh, because we're doing one, six, 12, 24. And you can offset this later on. Uh, but it's just kind of easier to uh, to kind of uh, teach people how uh, you know how it's being done because of the flip pose because I want it to be equal so it's easily understood then you can just retime it okay so we can go to frame six again left foot is forward right it's up right there so um, I mean it's the one kind of standing so here we're gonna go grab the main body controller okay and I can go here with the global setting it doesn't really matter and this is the highest position okay and uh, let's uh, probably right there okay and I have auto keying now so everything that I do here gets keyed but we're still gonna key everything manually so all right let me select the uh, foot so passing position again very exaggerated we want that flat and we want to rotate that one instead all right so we have that kind of passing all right let's take care of the arms so the this one right here should still be back by a hair okay and then let me turn on my screencast here so you see all the buttons I'm pressing all right, right here, definitely. A little subtle one right there. Okay, let's check that there's no collision. We're... Okay. And rotate that, kind of relax it. Okay, so let's say that's our passing position. All right, we're going to press A to select everything okay then K location rotation okay we're going to select this all right we're gonna select that and then we're gonna go post copy post okay and then we're gonna go here to 18 paste
post flip. All right. So the reason why it's, uh, even though I pasted it, okay, it's positioned right there and it remembered it because while we were in uh, playback before, uh, if you remember, we um, are in time, uh, we, we turned this off while we were setting up the rig, right? So, and I turned it back on before I did all this stuff. So now let's take a look. All right, it looks like there's a slight pause in there because um, we have to be watching this at frame 23 because that would be continuing from one, right? So I'm gonna go here, frame 23. So this would give us a smoother. All right, so there's that. So simple walk cycle. A little bit of fixing on, I don't like the one, the shoulder kind, I mean the elbow kind of pop in right there. You see it right there. All right, so we gotta we gotta take care of that right here. So when we did the pose, so let's fix it here so that we don't have to fix it over there. So right here we gotta relax this a little bit right here. So I'm gonna press G. Okay, let's see if that did it. Uh, okay. All right, so just being lazy here, I'm just going to press A on everything right there. Select this one here. Copy. Go over there and then flip it. All right, so I mean, I could have tracked that down and then just fixed that one right there. All right. We can add more to it, of course, but that's a walk cycle uh, 24 frames and we're only cycling it on 23 right there and of course if we want to uh, cycle this um, uh, playback uh, let's say we'll just keep walking like that and we can animate the um, the main uh, body controller uh, walking forward we could do that but we'll do that on the uh, on the running uh, cycle